hi guys good afternoon i hope you guys are well i have some words that i'm going to release for you guys today i'm gonna start off with this one and i'm gonna try to get the rest out later and i'm gonna try to get you know that video everything prepped for tomorrow for you guys okay so tomorrow 7 p.m that older video is gonna be out okay but anyways this morning i heard the holy spirit say boundaries boundaries okay and i didn't know exactly like why he said it but he was saying boundaries as in more of a reassurance and more of a yes have boundaries have boundaries kind of thing so later today i got the rest of the word and i just want to say for whoever you are you know it's okay to be nice it's okay to be open with people it's okay to be friendly with people right and i talked about that the other day how we just have that you know we just have that about us like we just have when we have the holy spirit in us and you have the fruits of the spirit you're going to be very nice to people. You're going to be very open to people. You may be very friendly and nice. But the Lord says also to remember to have boundaries because there are certain people, they see that you're very nice. And not only that, there's people that know you have the Holy Spirit within you. They know you have the fruits of the Spirit. They know you're a nice person. They know you're a kind person. But whoever you are watching that needs to hear this word, it's okay to have boundaries as well. Don't let people take advantage of you. Okay, it's okay to stick up for yourself. It's okay to have boundaries. However, the boundaries word <laughs> relates to you. I just know he said it very stern but he said it also in a reassuring type of way as in like giving someone the confirmation yes you need to have boundaries with this person or with these people you need to have boundaries this is a very important you know part of being sensitive in the spirit okay also knowing just how much you're willing to take knowing your boundaries setting a limit right because even sometimes when you're around certain people and you're sensitive you may get drained you may get very tired just being around certain people just talking to certain people and you have to also respect your own boundaries as in like when you feel like you're being drained or you feel like you're getting tired being around certain people maybe it's time for you to detach yourself maybe it's time for you to say you know what i'm going to cut the conversation short i'm about to go home etc you have to also respect your own boundaries but also you have to also make sure that even when you're entertaining people or talking to people in any type of way and i mean entertaining as in like conversations telling stories you know what i mean and speaking to people laughing engaging you want to make sure that you also set specific boundaries as well just to how much you're telling people how much you're saying to people and how much you're showing to people when it comes to your personal life as well yes we are very nice individuals yes we attract a lot of people that want to interact with us but also at the same time you're not only going to attract good people you're going to attract haters you're going to attract fake people you're going to attract people sorry people who are opportunist as well and you want to make sure that you are not crossing your own boundaries your own limits and putting yourself in a position to where you're able to be deceived a lot of us we've been through so much deception and let me tell you something it took a long time for many of us to get to a place where we're comfortable enough to even be in public some of us are still like okay let me relax for a bit. Anxiety's kicking in. Like this morning, I had a bit of anxiety. I was in public and I was still being myself, but I had a little bit of anxiety that came out of nowhere. And I could feel like, I could feel the anxiety like starting to come and I had to rebuke it and it went away. So we still have these days. We still have up and down days, right? And you have to understand that, you know, being outside, yes, there's a lot of good people and being around people in your workplace and stuff. Yes, there's a lot of good people. But also remember that not everybody that sees you and sees your friendly manner is going to love you. They're going to come around you sometimes because they, they may want something from you or because they want to suck your energy out. They want to drain you. Okay, they want to drain you. Um, it can also be just people that just know that you have favor on your life. Thank you for reminding me, Holy Spirit. Oh my goodness. Hallelujah, Jesus. Oh my goodness gosh god wow so he just reminded me of something so oh my goodness wow 
he just reminded me of something. So I saw something in the spirit and I forgot about it. And what I saw in the spirit was I saw that there was a lot of people who was favoring a person. Like there was a lot of favor around this person as in like everybody just wanted to be around this person. Everyone wanted to talk to this person. But in the in the spirit, they were clapping their hands. It was like a congratulations, yay type of thing. Like everyone was like, yay, and clapping their hands, congratulations kind of thing, right? And when I saw that in the spirit, I heard the Lord whisper, favor, favor. So there are people favoring this person like, hey, congratulations. Woo so I just remembered that. I just remembered that. And I'm so glad God reminded me of that at the perfect time because I was talking about how like, yes, there's a lot of favor that you may have, but you have to understand that there's people who will also want to associate themselves with you and be around you because of the favor that is upon your life. Okay, so this is why, thank you, Holy Spirit. This is why boundaries is so important. So this is the word. Like I received the word and I got the word, but he reminded me of that and it connects. Like it just, oh my goodness, God is amazing. That's what it is that's what it is the favor that is on your life you are going to attract amazing people but you're also going to attract people who are want are going to try to drain you may even try to come in and get information off of you just for the sake of using it against you so also have specific boundaries when you're conversating with people interacting with people entertaining people have certain boundaries entertaining also means like when you have a, a type of gathering whether you're going to a gathering or you 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 host a gathering right where people come to see you birthday parties whatever have specific boundaries up as well because the favor that god has on your life will attract good people but attract a lot of wolves okay it's okay to be to be nice it's okay to be friendly but just have some boundaries okay i just want to share that with you guys okay so um i'm gonna record the other word a little bit later today but i want to share that with you guys so confirmation for many people or for whoever's been waiting for confirmation relating to your boundaries word whatever <laughs> i love you guys i'll talk to you later bye